Thanks for tuning in to Cigars, Liquor, and More. As we get to know our buddies, Bill. Howdy. And our other brother, Daryl. What up, G? On their journey as they discover their thoughts on cigars, liquor, and anything else that comes to mind. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're on. I've lit mine. I have two, and right off the bat, I definitely, I definitely get a nutty flavor. I'm definitely getting the cedar. Yeah, and that's that's where I was going next. <laughs> uh, but man, the, this thing is psycho, and the fact that it's got a huge band. Yeah, yeah, I kind of feel like it's an extra binder. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. It's it it. big. It, I mean, it covers it the whole cigar. Huge. So the spirit that we have with it is a Vanilla Phoenician rum which has oak flavors followed by a sweet vanilla touch. This won the 2018 gold medal in the San Francisco Spirits. Uh, yeah, and its MSRP is around $25. So yeah, this it's, got is... a, it's got a really nice label on it. It's a good-looking bottle. It is. This is a Fijian rum? Oh, but we do want to mention that January 25th, we have the 2020 Winter Whiskey Tasting in five cities, uh, Dallas. Links on the website. Links on their website. I'm going to see if I can remember. This would be Dallas, St. Louis, Chicago, Denver, and Minneapolis. Sounds right. <laughs> I already have to remove the band. That's how big it is. I know. It's just uh, you're just right oh, there good news. Moving. It's not bad, and there's a, a sub band that's normal. <laughs> Look at that. Go figure. Normal sub band. It's a mild rum, and it's a <laughs> and it's on the drier side, like we said, more like mm-hmm. the Pompero. Um, I, I, Less dry, I, chilled. Out of, out of out of five, it's a two out of five <laughs> on sweetness, and it's not the driest. Yeah. It's it's right it's right before middle. It, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go with middle. All right, so that's it's middle of the road. It, that's but working it is out a well. Good rum. Uh yeah, and maybe get rid of some of the echo in my garage. <laughs> we need tapestries. Tapestry, do yeah. You need tapestry? We, we, we need carpets on the wall. That's what <laughs> I mean. Tapestry is really just carpet on the wall, right? Very much. Yeah. And tapestry is cool. Tapestries are cool. Like Mr. you could put up sound foam, but that's yeah. not cool. Tapestries are so cool. They made it into an Indiana Jones movie. Uh, we did an interview with Acre Distilling in Fort Worth. We did an interview with Al Roman from the Good Cigar. Good times. Uh, Brent Richardson, who had just come back from Cuba. A real surprise. I wasn't sure where that was going. I didn't know that it was a, a, a peacekeeping mission. Um, let's see. We also we also put out the CLM Cigar Journal. Oh, published. Published. We published. are published. We have an ISBN. We do. I And I have been writing fairly religiously in my cigar journal. Me too. And uh, I I like it. And I, that's one of the things that I think has helped with uh, picking out flavors and tastes. And now that it's warm, it's sweeter. It's sweeter, and I'm getting the woodiness. Are you? Yeah, I'm still... I, 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 don't get I'll, me wrong. I'll get mine warmed up then. I'm still not getting the vanilla, but you should totally... If you got the vanilla before, you should get a ton of vanilla when it's warm. Vanilla loves warmth. so <laughs> That it does. But I'm getting really woody now. So I'm using my leg to yeah. warm it up. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, there's that, and this um, this psycho is it's a it, it's a mild to medium. I wouldn't even give it a yeah. full medium. It's a mild to medium. Ooh, yeah, but I'm I'm liking it. I'm liking it. It's it's yeah very pleasant. Yeah, and I'm starting to get more of the cedar taste out of it. Yeah, see, I like the cedar, and I think I I have a feeling that most of it comes from aging. But I taste cedar a lot in Sumatras. Oh, oh speaking of which, uh, we'll also be raiding another Balcones in the new year. Yeah. So I I went and splurged. So <laughs> the Balcones single malt. Not the brimstone. Not the brimstone. The Balcones single malt is very highly rated. And they came out and then they, they had me at cask. Texas Whiskey Trail. Woo-hoo. So I'm like, you know what? This is this. I got a nickel says it won't be long before even Balcones isn't available to me. <laughs> even though I'm two hours from Waco, it will <laughs> probably not be that long before that bottle's not available to me. I better pick up a bottle now. 
I mean, it's getting good ratings. I got to get a Garrison Brother bottle. I need to get all these guys from High the trail. ratings internationally. Internationally, yeah. Wow. So I, I want to go through, and we talked about the Whiskey Trail before, mm. and I wanted to say we, we need to walk. We need to get through that thing, even if we don't physically go to every distillery, which I totally want to do. Oh, yeah. We at least need to go through all the bottles. I Definitely. mean, we just we do now. Some of them we've had, some of them we haven't, right? Mm-hmm. All as right. A, well, we're in the we're in the back stage. third of this, and this has just been a great smoke throughout. It's a it's a definite. Ah, all right, it could be a medium for really mild people, but for me, it's a mild. Yeah, I. If I, you're a mild person, then this might be a medium. Yeah, I'm I'm going more towards the mild end of the spectrum. Um. It's got it. It's got some really good flavor. I think this would be great for somebody stretching out from a mild, who wants to stretch, who wants to stretch their palate a little bit from yeah, a mild. Yeah, not a bad I idea. That, I think this would be a great stick for that. Right. If you stick to the mild Romeo and Julietas and the mild um, Monte Cristos and the mild Partegas, which are all very mild cigars, or then this might be the place where you take that step up yep so and we'll have more giveaways in the new year too i've got some some more stuff to give away Woohoo! i got a lighter an ashtray um I, we got stuff we got stuff cheers to all <laughs> going well uh and thank you to our listeners thank you to those that uh that comment post um you know those that that talk to us outside of outside of the podcast uh, it's been great. We yeah. appreciate you. It, it has been great. <laughs> I love people that are listening. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> well, I feel better. Heck, yeah. <laughs>